Hello and good evening, I'm Ethan Burks. The State Department of Health is reporting over 2,500 people have tested positive for the coronavirus in Indiana. Of those people, 65 have died. The numbers in Monroe County have now reached 33 confirmed cases. The Indiana National Guard announced today it will coordinate with food banks across the state to help distribute food to those who need it. Indiana officials say the state's capacity to test people for the coronavirus is increasing, even though the lab results have slowed over the past few days. Governor Eric Holcomb believes that should be the state's top priority. Every time I talk to anyone, I say we need more. Pour it on. Um, we're, we're not content um, right now. We can always use more. Health officials say the growth in testing has slowed because the state can't control how quickly outside labs report their numbers. Health Commissioner Chris Box says she's confident the testing is increasing despite what the numbers are saying. And schools around the state are doing what they can to keep providing meals to children while the schools are closed. In Brown County, more than 500 students are handed curbside meals every day. So we grab them a, bro a breakfast and a lunch, and then we so and then we do it. So if today's your day, we give you two bags, one for today, one for tomorrow. We also have some students who have some backpacks, so there's some canned food items here that have also been donated. Families register online where they can then go pick up the food or have it delivered to their home. Distribution for meals is Monday, Wednesday, and Friday from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. Funding for the meals is coming from the federal government. And for weather tonight, we're looking at partly cloudy skies with a low of 36 degrees before the sun comes out tomorrow and it's 63. Sunny again Friday before more chance of weekend showers once again. For more local news and information, please visit WTIUnews.org.